in this video we are going to look at how to create an intersection uh, from existing alignments and uh, profiles uh, with the uh, offset alignments so previously we have created the uh, intersection here uh, and in this video we are creating the intersection here so this file we are using is the intersection create 3 you can find the location of that file from here so as i told you earlier in the video series you can uh, check in the description uh, for other videos related to this intersection creation and editing intersection so i am going to create the intersection now i will go to home tab and go to intersections and go to create intersection then in the for the intersection point i will select this intersection of this road A and C. So my primary road will be road A. So I will select the primary road. So in the intersection wizard, so our primary road or road A crown will be maintained. So I will click next. And this time we are using the offset parameters for the alignments. Initially we use offset parameters using the offset value, but this time we will use an existing alignment for the offset parameter so we will set the offset parameter existing alignment years and from here we go to select the alignment for the left side and click ok and in the same manner we go to set the right side alignment also for the offset parameter and click ok so then we create new offset for starting and end profiles so we will be uh unclear unchecking this option and we will click ok so then you i go to curve return parameters where i can set up widening lanes here we will set up widening lane to south east quadrant widening turn lane for incoming road and north west quadrant widening lane for incoming road so after setting those values we will click ok then we will go to lane slope parameters because we are using the existing alignment as offsets so we have to give uh, slope parameters there so for the existing profile on the left side we will use years and we will uh, use the road a minus minus two percent one for the left parameter and so be, uh, for the right side you will use this one so if you check the alignment and profile views in the drawing you can see these values are these profiles are set in this drawing so i will click ok now then i will go to uh, next then i will create intersection for an existing corridor so we will have the existing corridor here and my surface today like will be existing brown then i will use this autodesk uh, metric assembly set for this intersection creation and i will create the intersection so you will get some errors actually if you use the autodesk file you will get some errors but uh, they are not in this corridor but it is in the other corridor in this corridor those errors are happening in this corridor uh, and here also we are getting a uh, bow t here so you can see how to clear these bow t's uh, in a separate video if you browse through uh, youtube so that is how to create an intersection uh, for an existing uh, road or existing offset alignments so far we used uh, in the earlier tutorials we used the offset values we manually entered the offset values but in this case we used our offset alignments and offset profiles uh, by default in the not actually uh, uh, offset profiles which was in the drawing already so this is how to create intersections using uh, intersection wizard in civil 3d in the next tutorials we will see how to edit these intersections how to edit the corridor how to edit the alignment how to 
did the vertical profile in uh, civil 3D intersections.